I have here an antique fly fishing rod kit. And the really cool thing is it has this little compartment here with the flies. Fly fishing, I mean, it, it looks cool. I mean, they're out there making the fish jump out of the water and making the fly kind of dance. Right. I'm more of the uh, other kind of fishing. That's me too. To sit on the dock in a chair, not even holding a pole. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> This antique fly fishing rod is in immaculate shape. It's never been used. It appealed to me because it's got that old kind of nostalgic fly fishing feel to it. I'm hoping to get uh, around $200 for my antique fly fishing rod. Oh, this is really cool. Fly fishing's been around forever. I mean, they're actually doing it in Macedonia, like 200 AD. Wow. Fly fishing was like probably the most like fancy way to fish, I guess. I mean, it's actually called angling. Fishermen use <laughs> nets and boats. Anglers actually stand in the water with a pole. I'm an angler, not a fisherman, yeah. I mean, it's in really good shape. What's it made out of, bamboo? Yeah, split bamboo. OK. And they use bamboo because it's strong, and most things are going to snap. So. <laughs> it looks 40s, 50s, maybe. Right. It doesn't look like it's ever been used, though. That's the cool thing. I mean, it. Yeah, it supposedly it wasn't. How much are you looking to get out of it? Ah, uh, hey, 200. 200, huh? Yeah. Honestly, buddy, that's probably what I'd be able to sell it for. Um, I'll give you like 75 bucks. You think you can cast out a better price? Like 120? Because of the weird fishing reference, I'll give you 100 bucks, but I can't go anymore. <laughs> Okay, I'll bite. 100 bucks? <laughs> Thanks.